Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can create a burn down chart in Trello. So let's get right into it. Now, the thing we're gonna be using for a burn down chart is a power up and the power up that we're gonna be using is a burn down charts by, I forgot what it is. So let's just search for it by Corello. Yep, just click add that and click add again. Now, if you haven't authorized it already, you're going to have to authorize it right now. I have everything authorized, so I'll just click enable the board and then choose the backlog list. I'll choose backlog to do and doing, and I'm going to choose done as the completed list menu. And now I'll select count by number of cards. You can also count card points. I'll just select number of cards. It doesn't really matter. And then you can select to receive daily email burn downs if you want to, as well as Slack updates, which I won't be doing. And now that everything is set up, I'll just click start sprint, select the duration, click start again. And as you can see, now you have your burn down chart. As you can see pretty much daily, the amount of cards will go down. And this is what your burn down ch chart is going to look like. This is going to what it's going to be like uh, through the duration of your sprint. And once you reach the end, or in this case, Sunday, the 22nd, just click and sprint. And that is exactly what it's going to look like. You can also click new sprint, select the duration again, and it's going to change the burn down chart as you can see here. But that all depends on what you set up. And that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.